Welcome to Dabble Art Gym. We are your coaches, Dee Dee and Summer, and this is where we train you to work out your creative mind. This week, we will show you how to find your flow. If you missed our first video explaining what flow is, click the link in the description below. But before we begin, please subscribe and turn notifications on so you can get alerted every time we release our newest Dabble exercise and motivational hack. Today we want to share with you how we implemented dabbling as a self-care practice into our lives. We learned how to call in flow, which ultimately is a relaxed state of complete happiness. So here's the thing. We understand that creating can be intimidating. In Picasso's words, every child is an artist. The problem is how to remain an artist once we grow up. In most cases, when a child is given art supplies, they are most likely going to dive in and explore. An adult, on the other hand, who may not already consider themselves an artist, may hesitate. Next time you sit down to dabble, try asking yourself, what would my 7-year-old self draw? Most adults get caught up in the end result, whereas kids are more fascinated with the present moment. That creative inner child is still a part of you. Here are four exercises we like to do to calm the nerves and make room for flow. Try these in a safe space where you can feel comfortable and avoid distractions. And this is a workout, so the best way you'll see results is repetition, repetition, repetition. Because dabbling is an exercise for your mind, it's good to warm up. It's normal to have anxieties when creating art. Even we still get them. So to get rid of these negative thoughts, you need to learn how to connect to the now, the present moment. Deep breathing can immediately lower stress by slowing down heart rate and lowering blood pressure. By practicing deep breathing, you can learn how to connect mind to body and ultimately let go of fears. Try taking a deep breath in and let it out. If your shoulders go up and you feel as if you were growing taller, this is surprisingly incorrect. Instead of expanding your shoulders, try placing a hand on your chest and focus on keeping it still. Inhale while pushing out your abdomen and pull it back in on your exhale. Think of pushing out your belly button on your breath in and pulling it back toward your spine on your breath out. Now is the perfect time to follow along with us as I guide Dee Dee. Once you are in a comfortable seated position, close your eyes. Sit up straight, shoulders back and down. Align your spine to your sitting bones. Put one hand over your heart and the other on your belly. We'll start with a few quick cleansing breaths. Take a deep inhale through your nose and let it out through your mouth. We'll do this two more times. In, expand the diaphragm. Out, contract the abdominal muscles to push out the air. In, and out. On our next breath in, take three seconds to inhale through the nose. In, one, two, three. Hold for one, two, three, four and out through the nose for five, four, three, two, one. Again, in for three, hold for four, three, two, one, and out for five, four, three, two, one. Keep going just like this. Focus on the breath. Now bring awareness to your inner body. You are here, you are now. Just keep breathing. If thoughts arise in your mind, and they will, simply acknowledge them and bring your awareness back to your breath. In and out. When you feel ready, slowly bring your awareness back to your body. Take one more big cleansing breath in through the nose and out 
through the mouth. If you followed along with us, you might be feeling pretty good right now. Hopefully you have cleared your mind and created space to welcome in positive thoughts. And with positive thoughts, we can create positive actions. But how do you obtain positive thoughts before your doubts start creeping back in? Positive, positive affirmations. affirmations! Positive affirmations are statements used to challenge negative or unhelpful thoughts. You can use any of these affirmations as examples, or you could create your own. I, I am, am patient. patient. I am, I able, am able to express, to express myself, myself freely, freely through creativity. creativity. The creative, creative power, power of flow, of flow lies, lies within, within me. me. I am, I am inspired, inspired by the beauty, beauty in my life, life and all around, all around me. me. I, am I am willing, willing to, experience to experience my creative, my creative energy. energy. My creativity, my creativity has, has no, no limit. limit. Don't focus so much on the outcome, but think about how you're feeling right now, right before you start. What kind of mood are you in? What kind of colors do you see? What technique do you feel like starting with? This is your time to create whatever you want. It's your time to just be in this moment, be with your paints. Let your hand and your mind guide you. It's so fun to see what you come up with if you just Run with the moment. Let's get back to that inner child we were talking about earlier. Think about a young child's mind. When they are playing, they are really in it and present. Children wonder how things work. They want to get down to the root of things. Try using the same amount of presence and apply it to your brush strokes. Just kind of playing around with my brush and remembering the techniques from the earlier videos. Some fun things to think about while you're painting are what kind of sounds do you hear? And are there certain strokes you enjoy painting more than others? If you start to lose focus, don't get discouraged. You can always come back to the breath. Breathing usually helps me get back to doing what I'm doing right here in the moment and not letting my thoughts go crazy. At this point, you have let go of unnecessary thoughts with breath work. You have welcomed in positivity and you are focused. But now you have to keep it going. Music is our answer. Tuning into music while dabbling keeps the flow state going and keeps the process fun. Think about how some people like to listen to music when they are working out to stay in the zone. Listen to music that moves you. Try doing this. Find music that fits your current mood, then paint it. Pick colors the music is making you see. Move your wrist and elbow to whichever direction the music may be pulling you. We'd recommend connecting to good speakers or headphones and really get lost in the music. If you would like to listen to our recommendations, you can find the mixes that our DJs have posted online. We hope you had fun learning these exercises. You can find a breakdown of them on our website at dabbleartgym.com. In our next video, we will guide you on how to dabble in watercolor to paint a whale. If you would like to follow along with our exact materials, you can order a watercolor package in our Etsy shop. You can find the link in the bio. Visit our website and subscribe to our emailing list to stay up to date on all our newest releases. Check out our previous videos on how dabbling can be used as a self-care practice and we also go over fundamental watercolor techniques. Please subscribe to our channel so you can be alerted when our videos come out every other Thursday. 
Also, please like and share with your friends.